Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to a new video. Today, as you can see, we're playing some Nidalee Jungle. It's going to be a Nidalee Jungle gameplay guide. I'm going to be showing you guys what I would do to carry myself out of low elo. Give you guys some ideas about what I'm thinking about when I play the game. And just in general, show you guys a bit of elevated gameplay. As many of you know, I'm not like a Nidalee main or anything like that. I play Nidalee kind of like fun recreationally, but... Uh, still should be a lot to learn. Also, you'll see that we got that ward out on, um... Master Yi's Raptors. That's because we saw them invading my bot side. I don't know if I turn on the recorder just in time for you guys to see that or not. I will tell. I don't really like smiting the blue. Oh, I missed an auto. Oh, that really hurt me. Yeah, I missed two autos there. Yeah, I like smiting the grump over the blue. Um, I don't know if that's like meta or not. Or if that's just personal preference. Alright, so for clear, I'm going to be doing blue into grump into wolves and then we'll assess the situation afterwards as per usual. I uh, should have hit an E proc there before I uh, trigger formed. Also, see this E mid. It's yeah, good to be here. Um, we see E going to his wrapped camp. I'm kind of keen to go and have a little walk around over here. Should have queued already. Oh, he is going a little bit hard there, though. Okay, is she going up? Sorry, there's a few plays going on here at once. Yes, she is, by the looks of it. Oh my goodness, man. Where are you going, Zoe? Oh, shit. Holy shit, a little bit yikes there on the queues towards the end. Kind of keen to just fuck around with this Zoe a little bit here. I think there's very little chance of me dying. And the more I fuck with her, the better the situation gets for my teammates. I do see Yi here, he does have a longsword and he has smart advantage, so unlikely I can get this off, but again, I'm kind of just uh, keen to see what I can do. Oh shit, he has smart. Ah, uh, fuck it, flash, pardon me. And space him on the queue. Oh my god, said help, please, buddy. Beautiful. Alright. Now, <clears throat> look, obviously I have utilized mechanics that uh, you may not have. So, yes. Fair criticism. Um, that being said, I think that, you know, these all things... Uh, I actually think this is probably better. Um, that awkward buy. I should have done one more camp. Um, yeah, as I was saying, I do think these, however, are things that you want to be uh, aiming towards getting to. The gameplay loop, though, can be followed. Um, obviously, this is lower elo, too, so I should have a higher elo in the early game coming out sometime in the future. I have a higher elo account I'm playing on at the moment, too, for recording, so when I uh, log back onto it, 
you'll probably see one of them, but it'll be a few days away uh, from coming out, you know, maybe like a week or something. I have a fair few uh, videos pre-recorded right now, so there's a bit of a backlog. Um, that's what's actually going to hit the tubes. Not like I can kill. I'm a big noob. It's a little bit odd for me. I don't really know how much damage I'm going to do to these camps because they're all level 1 camps still. And I have a lot of gold right now. Alright, how... Oh, I don't think I can do this, can I? I don't get the order. No. Oh shit. Fuck my life. Really nothing? Not a thing? I did find her, but I hit that. <laughs> Alright, over to Boy Grubs. Yeah, I did pretty bad there getting hit by the um, Zoe bubble, I'm not gonna lie. Always, by the way, guys, making sure that you maximize your um, passive whenever you're playing Italy. Trying to hit um, you know, the monster always with your Q, your Kugel Q, pardon me, to get the uh, damage enhancement. And then cycling through W's to get more W's out of your clear. Alright, let's uh, quickly go down here. Let's take out Gromp. And then we'll start uh, pathing towards invading Yeast Red again, I think. Yeast Red is a long time until spawn though, because it ended up being taken so late last time. I actually think the play here is to go to um, top lane and see if we can kill Gwen. Ah, oh, damn, she's left. Sucks. Alright, we're gonna jet over and take this now. He's getting bot. Didn't know that he was bot side. I think he might be trying to do drag there. Um, not sure about that play from him. back quickly go take this wolf camp and then we're chilling surprised that uh my mordecai just being me given i won his lane for him i do not know how he has managed to uh enter back to the gwen given i got her some that killed her and also took her out of lane for a long time that's fine we don't have to uh contest this drag by the way brothers because we've already taken one um set of grubs. I'm happy to handshake over the drag, let them take drag. You can't do every single thing at once, and uh, losing drag, especially this drag in this game, not super concerning to me. They don't really have any enchanters, any shields. I'm pretty chill with it. In all honesty. What might Gwen do here? Hmm. I think there's a decent chance you might try and walk into his uh, bot side jungle here. Beautiful. That's why your map awareness is really, really important, ladies and gentlemen, and why I tab in FQ so often, as uh, many low rank players complain in my uh, YouTube comments. But it's very important. Something you must do. Beautiful. Fresh coming too. Wonder if this Gromp is up. It is. Hello, buddy. Yeah. 
Yeah, we've completely taken this game over at this point. Oh shit. Ah, god damn it. Sucks. <clears throat> Alright. It's fine. I have, uh, you know, well overstayed my welcome on the rift, so I'm not, like, super upset about this, but in an ideal world, I didn't die there. Alright, here we are going to just quickly run straight to grubs, actually. I was gonna, like, see um if i could go to my red thingo grubs but i really don't have that much time to do that and you know i really don't want to let you get any grubs six grubs is going to be pretty big for my team and for us ending the game quickly so i want to get up here asap One health. Fuck. I'm here, brother. I to KS that with his ult. Peculiar. About that one. Hmm, shit. He's getting the, uh, Ginks off bot. Actually, I'm going to do this blue before we go anywhere. Also, ladies and gentlemen, if you're not as fed as I am, I wouldn't go Storm Surge. I'm just going at this game because I'm really, really quite fed. Um, but I don't know that Storm Surge is actually that good if you're not really fed. I think probably what a lot of people would do here was they would go Zonya's as their second item um, and then Rabadon's as their third. And that's like a much better, more rounded build. In my opinion. Alright, so we're gonna kill this. We're gonna instantly reset and run straight to the uh, Herald. Oh, that's so brutal. That's what it is, though. Ah, fuck, I'm waiting. 30 gold, it is what it is. What can we yap about in the interim? Um, if you guys like coaching, go to coachmiga.com. Also, if you've liked the video so far, make sure to like and subscri subscribe. Pardon me, so you can catch more of these in the future. Also, I am taking somewhat requests for um, other champions that you guys might want to see, or builds on specific champions that you might want to see tested. So if you have either of those, leave it in the comments if it's uh, seemingly something that the community once um you know a fair bit then i'm gonna be doing a fair few of those types of things all right i mean they're doing drag i would like to contest it but oh shit Oh, get this guy. Oh, hell no. Yeah, I mean, look at Slow Elo, ladies and gentlemen. Um, well, at the end of the day, there's what some of you guys need to see. All these Slow Elo games are very, very carryable if you are... Uh, 
you know, play in a certain way, which, uh, you know, does require skills that you might not have now, but definitely skills that every single one of you watching can learn. I think I said this in the last Lowy Low video that I recorded, but, um, you know, a lot of people fall into these, I don't know, I want to say delusions, but it's not quite the right word, but it's like these like belief systems where they just think that, you know, there's like some magic luck element or something that's going to, uh, dictate what happens with your rank journey. It's not the case. All right, nice. Let's quickly do this Herald. Um, let's also plug the coaching for these guys. I think this game's over in the very near future. And yeah, it should be probably ending this game around 19 minutes, provided nothing catastrophic happens, no really large mistakes occur. And um, yeah, it's kind of what you want to do on a lot of Nidalee games too, is, you know, really dominate the games so that you end out the game really quite quickly. That also means when you have a huge lead like I do, that you're not spending too much time clearing. You want to make sure that your clear is really, really quick so that you're at all the plays that you can be at. And obviously your clear is a lot quicker when you are super fit too. We're going to go Rabidon's as our third item here, ladies and gentlemen, and then Zonya's as the fourth. Let's uh, quickly plug the coaching. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. All right, let's keep going. Pretty much as soon as we take this blue, we can um, recall for the Rabadons. A lot of healing there. nice stuff there by my teammates not gonna lie um and yeah it looks like we're ending about that 19 minute mark like i said hopefully we can kill that yes we can nice keep the herald alive as long as possible we do have it spawned it is ready She had fucking flash. I'm dead here. I am dead here. Not bad, not bad by them. We're slowly ending this game out. It's taking a little bit longer than I would like, but results should still be the same. Um, yeah, Storm Surge was uh, completely worthless, I think. Unless I am not using it right. <clears throat> I don't know. It's kind of nice, though, the move speed. 
What, 385 damage? I think I would have preferred to have had a Zonia's already, not gonna lie. These guys, though, they don't want to give up. So I guess we're going to go do red into dragon and then um, try and do baron and end off that. I'm going to start peeing the barons for my teammates to know what I want them to do next. Ideal I was not tanking just because I dealed most damage. There's a spot though there. Might be just the case that I'm overkilling them too quickly actually. For the uh stop search to kick in. Okay, a couple boogie men there. Just these guys do not give in. I don't want to get baited into going in. Yeah, this game would have been a hard game for my team to win, I think, if I wasn't in it. Nice. We'll plug the uh, coaching to these guys. If you guys would like coaching, you check out the coach at coachbargain.com. I can teach you exactly how to up your gameplay and start carrying games like this. Also, if you like the video, make sure to like and subscribe. I'll show you guys the runes that we took here in a moment. My apologies on the voice too. It's probably not up to par with the usual videos. I'm still a little bit sick, so yeah, it's a little bit annoying. Those are the damage numbers, these are the runes, and that's going to be it for this video. Until next time, guys, take care, good luck on the rift, and peace out.